Well, new at noon, hundreds of sailors are finally home. USS Porter made its way back to Naval Station Norfolk this morning. Now it marks the crew's first deployment after shifting home ports from Spain. Casey Baylor explains why this homecoming is so special. Heroes are home. Crew members aboard USS Porter reunited with family after being away for four months. Four months. Four months never feels like four months. Diana Vargas says it's emotional. Oh, I mean, we really sacrificed a lot not being able to see our husbands and having to take on everything at home. The crew arrived at Naval Station Norfolk Friday morning, greeted with flowers, signs, and big hugs. This is Porter's first deployment from Naval Station Norfolk. The crew spent seven years in Spain before shifting ports in October. It seemed like every other day we were out to sea. It was tough. It was tough, but we made it. Uh, we accomplished the uh, deployments out there. Then crew members spent a few months here in Hampton Roads training for this deployment. So to be back home this time around means spending much more time with family. First of all, we noticed the humidity is much, uh, much different than it was back over in Europe, but it's very nice to be back home. Commander Joe Hamilton says crew members worked in the Baltic Sea and conducted exercises with allies. We did a lot of live fire events off the coast of uh, the UK's Hebrides range, which is basically northwest of Scotland. Now the crew will occupy their time with family. Spending time with my uh, mother-in-law and father-in-law, they just came from Texas and he actually hasn't seen them over a year and a half. In Norfolk, I'm Casey Baylor for 13 News Now. USS Porter team received the Battleship Effectiveness Award when they arrived home. This means the ship is the best within its squadron. A big welcome home to everyone aboard.